Hey everybody, here we are for match one. We've lost the die roll. Our opponent is deciding whether or not to play first. And we'll see what we get. 17 lands. I shouldn't be getting a one lander or a no lander, right? Let's see. Yeah, that is a utterly keepable hand. Both colors. We've got a two drop into a three one flyer. Our opponent's meld to six. Feeling good. Feeling good. We 3 0 today. That's what we're going to do. Maybe. What are we up against? We're up against black. Ooh, we even top deck the one drop. What other color are we up against? We're up against green. Yay. Gonna get ya for one. Gonna drop a prism. Oh, the improvise is so real right now. Gifted Etherborn, ro ro. Well, we've got an ice over for it. Um, we also have a poisoner. So we could actually poisoner keep up rebuke. I like that plan. Rebuke held up. Or do I save it for the inevitable ridge scale Tusker? Night Market Aeronaut. Uh, honestly, a flyer is actually a little bit problematic. Because I plan on flying in a whole bunch very shortly. Um, yeah, sorry, but no. Sorry, but no. No attacks. Wuss. Um, well then, in that case, we'll drop the Screecher and hold up our other Metallic Rebuke. Rishkar. Yuck. Tap it for green. Tap it for green. Yeah, tap it for green. Gonna ice you over, gonna ice you over so hard. Can't attack. Um, well, can make a servo. Do I wanna make a servo? Not terribly. Eh, it's past turn. So I can make the Crusher next turn. Trumpeter? Sure. Opponent's down to one card in hand. Tidy conclusion, you say. Um, yeah, let's drop Crusher. Pass the turn. Depending on what happens here, just come in with Crusher next turn. If he triple blocks, cool. Ooh, Herder. All right. Well, even if he double blocks, we can hold up tidy conclusion and kill something. Two for one him. Um, yeah, let's crew the crusher. Crusher crewed. In for six. I feel like opponent takes it? No. Uh, sure, I'll do that. And I'll kill the herder. And the Pima, or Rishkar, rather, is his name. Uh, yeah, going good, going good. Resourceful return, bring back Pima, great. Great. Counter, counter, counter. Well, that's why we got the Poisoner. So it's going to be a 4-4? Four, four? Sure. Um, Bastion Inventor, eh? So if we come in, he double blocks again. And then can we bash an inventor? Oh, we can bash an inventor for like full mana. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's bash in again while he's tapped out. If I get to take down the trumpeter, I'm pretty happy with that. Yep, dead trumpeter. And we'll drop the inventor. 
and pass the turn. There it is. Why wouldn't we play against this stupid freaking card? But we uh, we kept our opponent's board light enough that we're actually relatively okay. Augmenting Automaton, calm down. Stop looking like you're attacking. Um, yeah, hey, want to trade your 3-3? Three, three? Probably not what I want to do here. I guess I'll just drop the Daredevil. All right, how do we get back in this? We draw Battle of the Bridge. We draw Not a Swamp. Um, yeah, want to trade? Sure, one more creature off the board. Barricade Breaker will start getting through. Um, Fen Hauler or another Bastion Inventor. Uh, improvise, improvise, boop, 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 and boop. What can I pump you up to right now? One, two, three. And if I play that land, four, so I can make it a five, five. Ether Poisoner, sure. Implement of Examination. Don't mind if I do. And I'll draw myself a couple of cards. A Swamp and a Barricade Breaker. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, oh, so close. But then it's just going to die to Ether Poisoner. So, you know. Um, if he does attack with that Poisoner, I'll trade with the Daredevil. Because then I get it back. But I doubt he'd do that. Does not do that. Ooh, my own Ether Poisoner. Um, yeah, let's come in with my Ether Poisoner. I really wish this automaton would come, calm down and get out of the red zone. I'll make a servo. You will take one. Ooh, trade poisoners. That seems really not good. There we go. <laughs> Does not trade the poisoner. Gives me the servo. Um. Yeah, we make another poisoner. Get two more energy. Drop an uh, land. Pass the turn. It might come in with the automaton next turn. Essence extraction on the poisoner. That's gross. Got it. Still, one attack from the opponent's not really a big deal. Scrounging Bunder? Sure. So I can make that a 4-4. Four, four. Nope, no attacks. Cool. Don't even have to think about it. Uh, another land. So let's... 10 mana, so that's uh, 5, 5, 6, 6. Um, hmm. Yeah, you know what? Let's get rid of that poisoner. Augmenting automaton in. No. Augmenting automaton in. Ah, he moved slightly higher into the, the actual red zone. Um, okay. So you've got a trick. I would like to see it. Because then you have an empty hand. Natural obsolescence? Sure. You have no more cards. Tusker is going to become 7-7? Seven, 6-6. Seven? Six, six. Sure. Ambitious Aetherborn? Sure. <sighs> How do I 
get into this? I don't really know. Pass the turn. I have far fewer cards in my deck, too. Far fewer. I guess I drew... Well, I guess I've drawn three extras. Coming in. Yeah, I'll get rid of your Death Toucher. Um, sure, let's drop a breaker. So we've got 12 lands, so there's 5 left in the deck. No attack, sounds good. Breaker's going to trade with that, I assume. Boy, land ho. Tradesies, sounds good. Gonti's Machinations. So, what is this? Meh. Gave me that land. Perilous Predicament. So, that's mediocre. He'd sack that and that. That's real mediocre. Play land, pass the turn. <sighs> no attacks, pass the turn. 13 of our 17 lands. 4 left in the deck. And 13 cards. Hmm. Pretty sure our opponent is just going to outweigh us. 14 lands. 3 lands left in the deck. I lose three life, oh no. Revolt trigger? Revolt trigger. Okay, that's a slight problem. Uh, ambitious Aetherborn with a counter. Daring Demolition, that's a problem. That's a big ol' problem. Team? Well, the big ones at least. Five, nine, eight. Block with everybody. And I'm left with a four four. <laughs> All right, two lands left in the deck. I will take five. Hinterland Drake. Um, I'll hit you for four. I will take five. Oh, that battle of the bridge is going to be huge. Just need to draw it. Cowl Prowler. Fenholler. Improvise, because I can. I'm not going to pay full mana cost for it. So we kill that, and we kill that. So I'll pass the turn. Oh, Battle of the Bridge, you're going to be so big. It's going to be the last card in the deck. Oh, it's going to feel bad. Yeah, you got no attacks. <laughs> oh, but how do I do this? 
How do I do this? I guess I just start attacking in the air, getting him down. And then I block and block. Yeah, let's go block and block. He'll kill the hauler. Ah! Sure. Ooh, doesn't kill the hauler. That's very good news for us. So we're going to kill the prowler because it's doing the most damage. <laughs> 16. I gained 16 life. Deal with it. Take 7. Verdant? Sure. That's going to get big. Counter, counter, but he's not going to be able to attack with that. Otherwise, he's going to take 7 again. In for 2, sure. Land, of course. Why wouldn't it be? In for 2. 9, 16, 17. There's no lands left in the deck. We have 5 real... Dr oh, come on! <laughs> Okay. Okie dokes. You have no cards in hand. Just pump it up. There you go. Also, why didn't you just tap the hauler and come in for 10, in for 12, take me to 2? Strange choice as opponent. Uh, perilous predicament. Sack your Aetherborn and your servo. Ha ha, gotcha. Gotcha. We draw. It's going to be a real card. It's going to be a glass blower's puzzle knot. <laughs> yup. Uh, well, let's play our last land. Let's play the puzzle knot. Uh, Daredevil's going to come back to hand. We're going to scry two. Okay. Windkin, I think we need. And we're going to have to trade Fenhaller for the Automaton. So Windkin, we want to draw. Contraband, we don't need you. So Daredevil comes back. That's a chump blocker. Oh, he's going to tap my drake. Taps the drake. So then I could bash in. But then do I just die? He's got 6, 11, 12. Uh, this is 4, so 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, I can't attack in because he's got exacties with the pacification array. Stupid friggin' array. At least this is a card that I feel like is really good at uncommon. It's not busted. It's just good. Real good. But in a set with so much artifact hate, it has a lot of ways to just say, no, you don't get to have that anymore. Um, yes, yeah, so we'll draw a card. It's going to be the Windkin. We will play... Well, no, we'll go to combat. See what he says. Tap the drake. So I could come in with the hauler. Yeah, let's come in with the hauler. If we get to kill Pima, cool. We get to kill Pima, cool. So I will drop the windkin. Improvise because I can, improvise because I can. So we have Contraband Kingpin and two other cards. And we'll get to see them both 
with the puzzle knot. <laughs> this game is dumb. <laughs> Opponent's got 14 lands, so they actually have three lands left in their deck. Half their deck is uh, still garbage. Uh, I'll take seven, gladly. You kidding me here? Why didn't you pump? All right. Uh, well, let's determine the rest of the game. <laughs> Treasure Keeper. Oh, yeah, Automaton, you're on the bottom. We knew that. Um... You can go to the bottom, which is basically the top. Treasure Keeper on top. Contraband Kingpin is underneath Treasure Keeper. Uh, so Treasure Keeper will cast the Contraband Kingpin. So you're going to tap the Windkins. So I can attack with one creature. So I will attack with the Drake take you to seven could have attacked with the oval chase I guess no because that can't block artifact creatures and then we'll drop a treasure keeper which we will not block with because I don't want to draw an extra card pump it up the rest of that song I don't know pump it up Play that land you drew. I knew you drew it. Please have drawn a land. Okay, so let's say he drew a land. He attacks in, we jump. He taps, and we can take him to five. And we have a contraband kingpin. So I will block. I'm going to lose by decking myself. So we go to combat, tap the windkin, sure. I will attack with hinterland, take him to five, drop the kingpin. I mean, we've lost. I'm pretty darn certain we've lost, but we're not going to go out with a, without a fight. So yeah, we'll trade with Kingpin here. Or not trade. I, I wish Kingpin would trade, but no, we'll chump with Kingpin. Gain a life. Draw our automaton. And then we did. Draw our automaton, which if our opponent has a good memory, they knew we just drew. Tap my windkin. Get in for two. Oh, <laughs> we're so close. So close! Three damage. It's the essence extraction that saved him. Oh, and we get Oval Chase back. Oh, <laughs> one more turn. One more turn. Opponent should not be wasting time here. Opponent should just be... Just hit F6, followed by F6. Although I guess they're up on the clock, actually. We're down to 12 minutes. And this is game one! Thriving Rat, sure. Ah, oh, opponent's going to make me lose on the draw. Womp, 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 womp. Draw a card, draw a card. I can't draw a card. Um, Yeah. <laughs> that was game one um boy boy what do we do what do we do I don't think anything was bad <clears throat> I was being just sarcastic and pessimistic when I was like I'll save the rebuke for the uh, Tusker didn't expect it to actually happen. Um, yeah, let's just go back in. I don't think I want to put in a metal, another rebuke or a negate. Um, yeah, let's just go back in. 
I will play first. I will keep this hand because it looks pretty decent. Opponent's gone to six. Five, 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 five. Five? Five. Five? Five? Five. Five? Six. Put a card on top. That's gross. Swamp and go. Ugh. I hate my life. Hate it. Drop the island, drop the poisoner, and go. Hopefully we get an attack and make a servo. Ugh. Alright. Um, will I trade? I really want that servo. Yeah. Let's offer the trade. Sweet. Good deal. Um... It uses not all my mana, but let's puzzle knot just to fix our draw a little bit here. A drake. So what are we at? Next turn we're at one, two, three, four, five, six. So we're still just off um, getting the barricade breaker anytime super soon. So I will just draw the drake and play it next turn. Get a flyer in the air. Rishkar. All right. Well. I made you not get full value off of it. Um, I'm not going to block, but I'm going to get to start attacking. The alternative is drop an implement. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, drop the implement. Next turn, barricade breaker. Force him to really start using that pacification array. Don't you dare, Tusker. In for three. I will take the three. <clears throat> Ooh, sweet. Uh, go to combat. Oh, shit. No, I shouldn't have done that. If he taps the servo, I can't barricade breaker. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you guys saw that. My hubris. We're really making our opponent think about tapping that servo down. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. Yeah. Yeah. Tap. 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 That's a 7-5. Oh. Thriving rats. Sure. In for three, I will take it. Um, go to combat. Um, there we go. <laughs> sure, you got it. I will Drake. I will ice over. Really? But why? Guess he just really wanted the counter? Well, I guess it taps for mana now, right? I guess that's a thing. <clears throat> Ambitious Aetherborn, sure. We gonna blow that up. Servo. Um, yeah. Let's just tidy conclusion it. Get you for nine. The chumps. The chumps. Uh, pass the turn. And then we will implement of examination, draw a couple of cards, so we'll be back up to three cards in hand. Opponents on one card. Three damage. Yuck. No follow up. Beautiful. 
Draw some cards. Bastion Inventor, Foundry Screecher, Treasure Keeper. Boy. Um, well, he's going to tap down the Barricade Breaker. Blue, one, two, three, four, five. Gets me a Bastion Inventor. Alternatively, no, there's no alternative. I get to cast one of these cards. Um, ooh, can I do Treasure Keeper? No, I can't do that, can I? Uh, one, two, three, four. Blue, one, two, three, four. four. Ooh, I can do that. Keeper. Blue, one, two, three, four, five. Yep. Keeper into an inventor. Oh, we need to play fast. Because we might have a game three. You don't have a counter spell. You're in black green. There we go. Bastion Inventor going to invent all of the Bastions. Um, so he'll tap the Drake down, which is fine. And I've got a 4-4, which blocks his rats. And it has X-proof, so it can't even be tapped down. Ether Herder, sure. Well, I guess this becomes a 4-5. Which I will take. But we're threatening some damage next turn. What do we get? We get a swamp, of course we do. Go to combat, you're gonna tap down the breaker. And then I'll attack for seven? Nine? Yeah, I'll just attack for nine. Breaker block or tapped, sure. Uh four, five, six, seven. Yeah, eight, nine. B E aggressive. If you trade, I get the cascade. Sure. I will take a free spell. Um, ooh, I could scry. Yeah, let's scry and ensure that we don't hit like Battle for the Bridge or something. Um, put that on the bottom and I will take a free Poisoner. Cast it, get a couple energy, drop my Screecher. Beauty. No attacks, cool. Draw a card, we get another Bastion Inventor, sweet. Go to combat, tap my breaker. Come get you for five in the air. Let's drop another Bastion Inventor. Pass the turn. Hey, hey, we got there. We got there, and we're almost back on the clock. So, we need to play a very fast game three. Very fast game three. Still don't think there's any changes whatsoever. Hmm. Do I want a counter for the array? I don't think so. There's nothing that I would take the counter, or that I would take out for the counter. No, back in. Back in, let's do this. Fast game three. Let's start off with a win. Um, Yeah, that's a hand. Boy, is that a hand. I will keep. No array. Sweet. Pass the turn. Two drops. Thriving Rats? Sure. Ether Poisoner. Down you go. Follow that up with maybe an Ether Poisoner, maybe a Drake. We'll see. Verdant A. I will take two. And then what? Um, do I want a servo? I think I want a servo. Ooh, opponent just takes the one. Um, in that case, we will drop the Drake. Start getting in the air. Didn't use the energy. Wait, what? What else in his deck used energy? I guess the ether herder? Yeah, ether herder. He wants that to be bigger. Well, I've got poisoners for days, so you know. 
Um, I will attack in the air for two. And then I will drop um, Oval Chase, I guess. Yeah, Oval Chase. <clears throat> In and in, Are they both gonna get counters. Oh, that's a servo. That's not a counter, right? Of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. Uh, let's kill the three-three. Because it's just gonna come back to hand next turn. Aeronaut. Oh, we are in bad shape for a Tusker. Tusker is going to ruin us. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Um, hmm. I guess we crush her because then we get back the oval chase and we can crew it with these. We can't attack with the drake anyways. Tusker me out. Oh, that's a problem. I will take three. Fenholler. Black, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, so close. Um, blue, one, two, three, four, five. Bastion Inventor. Poisoner. Um, hmm. Yeah, just a Bastion Inventor. Uh, take two. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't friggin' do it. Ugh, I hate this format. <laughs> this format's garbage because of this friggin' card and the friends of it. Scrapper Champion on Tethered Express. Mostly this card. Um, Contraband Kingpin, sure. Plus, um, I will attack in for two. Plus uh, another poisoner. <clears throat> we still might be in okay shape here. In for four, sure. So are you threatening me with a renegade's getaway here? Well, show me it. All right, bye-bye, Tusker. But hey, everybody who's like, there's totally answers for Tusker. There's removal in the format. Tusker's presence is still very much here. And unless I have a board wipe, ain't going to do anything. Um, hmm. Well, I can no longer really take four. So I guess I puzzle knot, and I need to hit, like, a battle to bridge or something on top. Island, island. Go away. Go away. Scry again. Ambitious Aetherborn. Go away. We require removal or we're dead. Black, one, two, three, four. Nope. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Nope. And nope. So I guess we can just pop the puzzle knot again on their turn. Ugh. Frig, this format sucks. So much. Still, this has been a fun match, as much as this format is garbage. Thunder, yay. Well, show me a battle or something. Oh, well, there's battle. Can I even kill anything with it? Black, one, two, three, four, five. I can kill that. Boop. Black, one, two, three, four, five. Gain five life. And now we have to draw tidy conclusions. Verdant Automaton, sure. Bunder, sure. Well, being in the loser's bracket for round two and round three, I still feel relatively confident. But this is just a BS deck to face round one. And I face it frequently in round one because it's a little bit overdrafted. Am I, am I just dead? I'm probably just dead, right? So I can kill that and take seven. I can block there. Nope. I can block there. Gain one. 
So I take six block there, take uh, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, four, five, six, seven. Um, yeah, let's do that. I think that's not lethal. It's close. <laughs> it's real, real close. Didn't even pump. Vicious Aetherborn, sure. Wait, am I suddenly back in this a little bit? Ice over, sweet. Ice that over. Um, black, one, two, three. So still can't do anything, but I think I'm back in this game. No idea how this happened. What was that attack? Um, yeah. A block. Trade. Get a swamp. Four, five, six, seven. We can drop a barricade breaker. Let's do it. Windkind Raiders on top? Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> ah! So dumb. All right. Time for us to start flooding the board here. Windkind Raiders, blue, blue, one, two, three, four. Tab a barricade breaker. Do your worst. I started playing slower. Ooh, doesn't tap it. Takes seven. Okay. Oh, I'm just dead. I'm just dead. Did I punt that game? There was nothing I could do, right? No, there was nothing really I could do. Good game, opponent. You almost threw it away, but you top decked your other bomb on common. Wow. Boy, this format is garbage. Um, yeah, uh, that was still a really fun match despite the garbageness of the format. I will see you guys for match two. Uh, I think this deck is going to be really fun for the next three matches. Um, see you then.